Okay, so we have this uh, Dell Latitude D630. So what we're going to do is uh, turn it on and see what happens. The user is saying that it has scrambled video, so it has power. And then you have the tile block artifacting. So we know that this artifacting here in discoloration uh, is a frequency issue uh, caused by GPU failure. We've seen it numerous times. But by example, we see that this is uh, the same failures as most Intel model Dells. You know, Dell doesn't really make AMD model. They only make Intels. But uh, just in the Studio series, same thing. In the Vostro series, same thing. In the Latitude series, the same thing. So we're seeing this as a repeat type deal. So what we're going to do is tear it apart and uh, refloat. We can see the bars going across, but what we'll do is take it apart, refloat, check everything, and make sure it's good, and then go from there. Okay, so we have the Dell now. We turned it on. We're going into the BIOS. So we'll see what happens. Uh, before we had uh, artifacting, where we had the four quadrants here, and this side was discolored, and this side was um, doing its thing kind of washed out so after we go into the BIOS we're gonna see if we can uh, see the DVD drive and see that the hard drives in SATA mode and stuff like that so this is pretty typical when you take it apart uh, you have to reset the BIOS battery so we'll just do F2 to go into the BIOS and we see everything's here so We'll go down to the uh, device information, and we see that uh, our video card showing up the way it is, the hard drive showing up, and the DVD drive showing up, and so is the wireless card. So we know that everything's working perfectly fine like that, and we do have this running on battery, so the AC adapter is not being sensed. So what we'll do is uh, exit out. Reboot the system and see what happens when it goes into um, if it'll go into the operating system. Now, a uh, good rule of thumb to keep in mind with these is that, um, and we have the Bluetooth being sensed also, is that um, you have to uh, reapply the thermal compound as with all the systems, and you have to burn it in. So what we're going to do is let this boot up and go into the operating system and um, check everything out. So we'll let it finish starting up the way it's supposed to and then we'll check it from there. Alright, so we have the laptop uh, started up and it's uh, running to the desktop so we see everything's good. It booted perfectly fine. So what we're going to do is shut it down and call it quits. Uh, it's been running for about an hour and a half so we're going to say that it's past the burn-in, and we see everything's going perfectly fine on shutdown. So we'll say this is done, put it in the box, and send it back.